This is a popular British high top van conversion. It says Peugeot on the nose and auto sleepers on the sides. Let's take a closer look before we go indoors. The base vehicle is actually Peugeot's popular boxer. It's a sibling to Fiat Staccato and it's actually made in the same factory. Here we see the newly facelifted version with these stylish new headlights and auto sleepers prefer not to cut holes in the sides of a panel van and install their own double glazed units. Instead they have the vehicle delivered with single glazed glass which gives a very very stylish look and also gives you some tinted privacy glazing into the bargain. Time to actually get inside and see what makes this British van conversion so popular. This is Auto Sleeper's Warwick Duo. And one of the things that makes it so popular is this amazing rear lounge. The good thing about this is not only have you got two very comfortable sofas, bearing in mind this is only a two berth vehicle so there are no rear seat belts, both of these sofas are well over six feet long. So it's very, very easy to convert them into two very comfortable single beds. And that's the only thing that the Warwick Duo provides. Up ahead we've got uh, the wardrobe, which is cantilevered to allow for foot room on this side. The washroom which includes an integral shower and a very very well equipped kitchen. The cab itself is well equipped but it doesn't actually play any real role in the living area other than providing somewhere to stow some kit when you're on site. Now we're here in the kitchen area, it's quite a narrow walkway in here and indeed the side sliding door is impeded to an extent by the washroom itself. However that's not too much of a problem because the rear doors of this vehicle open up so you can let as much fresh air in as you really want to. The kitchen is extremely well equipped, microwave up top, um, Thetford's half height cooker with integral grill and oven, three burner hob, a decent sink, but importantly two features in this kitchen that really make it very usable, lots and lots of work surface and some very good drawer and large storage, cupboard storage down below. The washroom has the classic auto sleeper setup of a drop down basin above a bench type loo. The shower, wet room shower floor has got two uh, drains to it and the whole thing actually really does make very good use of the available space. Understandably the Warwick's been a very good seller for auto sleepers for a number of years. So for 2015 uh, the company has fine tuned the layout a little bit to make it a bit more versatile and work a bit better. The wardrobe has got a little bit smaller, it's not quite so deep and not quite so wide to increase the amount of space in this area here. While here there's a cushion section, you lift out from the sofa the bases slide apart and a small table drops in to provide a compact two-person dinette. It's not necessarily really useful for uh, full-blown dinner parties, that can be taken care of by the freestanding table which is also supplied as an alternative and sets up in the aisle. It's a great idea, what it really does is make the Warwick Duo more versatile than it was previously. In the kitchen too, Auto Sleepers has removed the full cooker, that's a separate grill and oven, four burner hob cooker that it had before, and fitted the Thetford unit, the smaller Thetford unit that I had mentioned previously. And again, this has freed up storage in there and also provided that nice big slab of worktop that was missing before.